Hello, my fellow cigar smokers. Welcome to Smoker Spot and another episode of the famous Cigar Talk. Today, we want to check out what is the difference between a long filler, a medium filler, or a short filler. So, if you were always eager to know what is what, what is good, what is bad, and what the heck I'm smoking here, then stay tuned. Other day, here in the lounge, we had a nice chat. Uh, it was about premium cigars, prices, and then we came to the topic of uh, what is a long filler, what is a medium filler. So, I instantly thought that might be a good topic for uh, a Cigar Talk episode. Um, so, I hope you will stay here with us, even if you already know what the difference is, because it might be entertaining. Um, Right now, for example, I'm smoking a long filler. And in this case, it's the Camacho Hot Charger. By the way, a very good cigar. Uh, a while ago, we made a review of this one. Uh, link is over here. Or over here. Somewhere there. Uh, check it out, if you want to. So, what is the difference between a long filler? Or let's start with the uh, what is a long filler. Uh, very easy. We have three layers in the cigar. The wrapper, that's the leaf that everything is holding here, that you can see from the outside. Right below is the binder, and the binder is holding the filler. The filler is the mixture of different tobacco leaves that are rolled together in order uh, to give the cigar its unique taste. Um, and all of these three layers are made out of whole tobacco leaves. Uh, in case you don't know how a tobacco leaf is looking like, here's a picture. So as you can see, a pretty big thing. Um, so the people, the talkadors who, uh, who are making the cigars, they're taking this leaf and cutting it in shape. Uh, because for different Vitola, for different sizes, uh, the tobacco leaf itself needs a specific shape in order to use it. Uh, and the rest, so the cutoff of this, that can be ranging from one-fourth up to one-sixteenth of a, of a tobacco leaf, all this rest, so still you have then small stripes or um, other little pieces, but uh, they, are still, they are still solid. Uh, and these cutoffs are used for medium fillers, while on the other hand, uh, a long filler is used um, with the whole tobacco leaf. That's the main difference between the two things. Um, almost all premium cigars that we are smoking here, that we're talking about, are usually long fillers. A few? There are, but are out there a few cigars that are always in the, let's say, in the section of premium cigars that are also medium fillers. Um, because? Uh, in the medium filler, the cutoffs are only used for the filler. The binder and the wrapper is still made out of a whole leaf, so they can be damn good too. But uh, actually they are rare. Um, mostly you find when you go in your favorite uh, cigar store, uh, you will find long fillers. Uh, on the other hand, when you're visiting your neighborhood gas station, the cigars that they have in there, in these little tubos, uh, that are right next to where you're paying your gas, that is usually <laughs> a short filler. And it tastes like, well, I don't want to go into any details here. <laughs> it's not so good. If you ever tried one, you know what I'm talking about. Um, so that is a short filler. A short filler is... is is made of all the rest. They are very, very small pieces. They put this shit in a mixer, 
uh, and uh, cut it in tiny little pieces and they then wrap it around with a cheap uh, with a cheap wrapper and that's it it's really I never had in my whole life a good short filler uh, a cigarette is a short filler more or less uh, but even there uh, you're using paper instead of a tobacco leaf as a wrapper uh, that's the only difference more or less so if you're really into cigar smoking don't give it a try with don't go with the short fillers uh, if you never had a cigar and your first cigar is a short filler you will probably never try again a cigar because you think they all taste alike um, okay make a long story short that's the that's the main difference between it long fillers made out of whole leaves short fillers is crap don't smoke it I don't want to go into any details here medium fillers can be good uh, give it a try usually a little bit cheaper but it can be good too um, that's it so it was a very short cigar talk uh, nonetheless I hope uh, I was able to give you some information that you didn't know so next time when you're sitting in your lounge, in your bar, your favorite spot where you're smoking or in the backyard, in the garden, wherever and it comes to long fillers, short fillers, cigars, now you know. <laughs> I hope. Um, so if you want to, let me know if you ever tried a short filler, what you think. Uh, leave it in the comments down here. I would be happy to read it. Uh, if you're not subscribed to our YouTube channel, do it now. It's worth the time you are spending here. I promise. We'll come with more interesting stuff. Okay, guys. I hope you have a wonderful time. I hope you are smoking always good cigars. And I hope to see you soon. Enjoy your day.